New graduates entering the workforce for a program designed to help transitioning soldiers and recent veterans find a job. It is called the Veterans Electrical Entry Program, or VEEP for short, and it's connecting Alaskan heroes with vital resources. Joining us now is the Membership Development Specialist, Kyle Kaiser. Thank you so much for being here. Tell us a little bit more about the program. Yeah, so this program was created to help transitioning soldiers find uh, quality jobs once they exit the service. Usually the hardest part for a service member upon exiting is translating their skills they had in the military to uh, a civilian job. Uh, with this program, they're able to attend first year electrician's class and be enrolled anywhere in the country uh, upon completion of the program. And how many graduates did you have this year? We had 10 in our initial program and we're looking to expand it further. And you talked a little bit about it, but the common fields that VEEP graduates transition into. Talk a little bit about those. Uh, for this class, it's, it's the inside wireman or electrician. Um, the, the importance of this program as far as that goes is you don't have to have any background in uh, electricity at all while you're in the service. Uh, it allows you to transition and have a career in a field that, that's constantly growing and changing uh, without having any kind of prerequisite requirements other than being in the service. And why is this important and how does it help both the community and the soldier? Um, well, as a veteran myself, I like to say the two hardest parts in serving are when you enlist and you raise your right hand and swear an oath to defend the country. And the second hardest part is when you get out and going, how am I going to provide for my family uh, and pay my bills? With this program, we're bringing them into a program where they're going to receive uh, a quality paycheck, have retirement benefits, health care benefits. Uh, there's no guessing, what am I going to do when I get out? How am I going to provide for my family? It's all taken care of, and you know where you're going from here. And you talked about that a little bit, but what is the, the feelings as someone's getting ready to leave the service and transition into civilian life? Um, it's terrifying, to be honest. Uh, a part of this is the IBW Local 1547's effort to uh, affect um, what's a national statistic of 22 veteran suicides a day. Um, it's a huge problem. And uh, pay, benefits, et cetera, and, and security and, and a brotherhood is where uh, most members have issues when they exit the service, and, and our program is to help alleviate that. All right. Thank you so much for being here. You bet. Tonight, concerns over whether a popular baby sleeper product should be recalled after it was linked to dozens of infant